Hi, this is George Cow. So today I want to talk to you about bringing a spirit of playful experimentation to your work. The path to success doesn't have to be a path of stress. It can be a path of relaxed, calm, enjoyable productivity. Uh, I think about the Yoda from Star Wars. Uh, he is almost always calm, and yet he is so effective. Uh, even when he's in a um, uh, fight, you know, battling with the dark side, he does it with such a zen-like, um, masterful calm. And I want to share with you uh, two quotes. The first quote is from Bill Murray. He is the famous actor who was in Ghostbusters and uh, Groundhog Day. And he says this, Be sure you have to remind yourself, he says, that you can be the very you can do the very best that you can do when you're very, very relaxed. Whatever it is, whatever your job is, the more relaxed you are, the better you are. Now, by relaxed, he doesn't mean doing nothing and just uh, you know, taking naps and sleeping and, and uh, you know, resting in a lounge chair. He means being relaxed internally even as you are productive externally. So um, when you are writing an email to a prospective client, uh, when you're about to go and give a talk, you don't have to tense up and be nervous. You simply relax and enjoy the opportunity to play in that moment, to play with that work. And of course, this comes from a you might say philosophical or spiritual foundation, knowing that everything is going to be okay. There's a song that I recently uh, heard and, lo and love by the artist Daniel Namod, and what I'll do is I'll link to that song in this video, um, or below this video. Uh, the song is called Here, uh, Here Comes Nothing, or Here Goes Nothing, and uh, it's such a beautiful song. I'll, I'll link to it and you can listen to it and, and um, and in fact, this is something that I've been doing every morning as I make breakfast, is listening to spiritual music um, to remind myself of what this is all about and that everything is going to not just be okay, but everything is going to be amazing. Uh, I also do some spiritual reading the first thing after I get up. Uh, so I, I want to encourage you, if you are not in a practice of reading spiritual things, uh, whatever spiritual path and spiritual authors most inspire you, I encourage you to get back into the habit so you can constantly remind yourself. It's like mental hygiene. Mental hygiene is, and spiritual hygiene is kind of like physical hygiene. You don't just take one shower and then you're clean for the rest of your life. No, you take, a, you take showers regularly. You don't brush your teeth once and your, your teeth are perfect forever. You brush your teeth regularly. Same thing with mental and spiritual hygiene. You've got to keep it up so that you can continue to, to be reminded so the final quote I want to share with you is from Ralph Waldo Emerson, and he says, Do not be too timid or squeamish about your actions. All life is an experiment. The more experiments you make, the better. So may I remind you to bring a playful spirit of experimentation to all of your work today, knowing that you're going to be just fine.